Hi everybody, I hope you're doing well. Today we're gonna to cover how to buy a stock on the Charles Schwab mobile app using a limit order. We'll cover how to buy an option on the Charles Schwab mobile app in a separate video. But buying a stock on the Charles Schwab mobile app is, is straightforward. Um, from a subscriber perspective, roughly 13% of our total subscribers use Charles Schwab. For buying stocks, it's, it's pretty straightforward and usually folks end up using Charles Schwab because they have other equity and investments on it. But from an option perspective, um, again, we'll cover a separate video, it's not a great option unless you have a set amount in your account, which then enables a whole lot of other features. But back to stocks, all you do is you just tap on the search icon in the upper right, tap in the company you're looking to buy, in this case, T-Mobile, uh, that was a stock recommended by us today. It'll open up. I'll give you the standard stock details. Just tap on trade. If you want to tap on buy. Uh, you can reinvest through dividends. I typically don't, just pay it out. Um, not all options uh, have dividends. So just this is just specific to T-Mobile. We're only going to buy one share in this case. Tap on limit. The current price for this is $112.75. Uh, so we recommend that if you're placing a limit to use a half percentage point gain, uh, which will trigger the limit order. In this case, a half point is $113.31. So when it goes up by half a point, it'll just buy. Just be aware that in some cases, um, if you do place a limit, uh, it could go up and crash right away. So, you know, limit is, is a way to protect yourself from from buying into a dip uh, and only buying when it goes in the right direction. In this case, for stock, it's going up. But just be aware, it doesn't always work. It's not a perfect mechanism. You want to buy till uh, the timing is good until canceled, which means it won't buy until it hits that limit order. The challenge with the limit order is that if it goes down, let's say $2, uh, you have to go in and manually change your limit order so that when it does go back up, you catch it on the upward direction. It's a little more uh, manual intensive to manage the, the volatility uh, if there are some occur. So in this case, we're gonna, now that we're done, review the order, one stock, 113.31, a limit, good till canceled. Looks good, I'll hit review order. Still looks good. In this case, we'll place the order. We're after hours, so it'll get bought the next day. Uh, we received the order. We can look at the order status from here. It'll tell us the details. But that, in a nutshell, is how you buy a stock on the Charles Schwab mobile app using a limit order. Thank you for your time. Uh, if you have any other questions or do you find these videos helpful, please uh, let us know. We'll certainly make uh, more.